This show, this is your final opportunity. When these quantities are gone, they are gone for good. And then I am going to be a walking commercial for our today's special coming up at midnight because I don't care what kind of skin, old skin, new skin, sagging skin, wrinkled skin, we all have to clean our skin. And the best way to do that is with Michael Todd, of course, one of the most revered cutting edge beauty innovators in the world of beauty, 12 midnight, lowest price in history, lowest price in America on the best way to clean your skin. And if you think that washcloth is doing it, it's not. So we'll give you a little peek at that today's special. Actually, you know what, ladies? Maybe we could even grab me one so I can show you some of the great uh, colors. But in the meantime, <laughs> the always colorful Mark Gill. Hello. How are you? All right. In my oh, black stop, shirt. Stop, stop, stop. Uh-oh, I'm stopping. Those are like $160 on hsn.com. Wow. These two <laughs> knives. That's incredible. So if you just got the bread knife and the chef knife, mm -hmm. it would be about a hundred dollars more. Incredible. So the chef's knife, we say fifty dollars, but we've had it as recently as a couple of weeks ago on HSN.com for around that eighty dollar mark. The bread mark was around that ninety dollar mark. The vegetable knife, the knife block, the paring knife, the kitchen shears, the sharpening steel, and the paring knife. No partridge in a pear tree. I'll tell you what. Eight minutes or sellout mark. <laughs> Don't cut yourself. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Listen. These are the real deal. Look around the brands in your house and ask yourself how many of what I have in my home has been made with quality for our customers for almost 300 years. Guys, this is Zwilling. Zwilling means twins and twins mean Henkel. This is the real deal. These are the legacy knives. These are the ones that everybody wants. You're looking for that symbol right there, and you're looking for these words right here, and those say made in Germany. That's what you want. This is stainless steel, full tang, triple rivet, and Henkel quality. That's what we're talking about. Now, by the way, you are going to get the workhorse knives. You are going to get the 8-inch chef's knife. You're going to get the 8-inch slicing blade. You're going to get the 5.5-inch prep knife, which is my favorite, and you're going to get the the paring knife and the scissors and the seal and the wood you have to be kidding me. Okay, but here's the thing. You couldn't buy the butcher's block in your gourmet store for what we're selling the whole kit and right. caboodle for. So we'll show you that quantity left. There are 400 and 400 only. We actually have as many people calling as we do have quantity remain. Just like he had me at Hello, he had me at Henkel. I mean, honestly. So you're getting everything for a $20 bill, but it is for this show and this show only. Like a, like a knife through butter, like right? Like a hot knife through hot butter. Knife like through I said, butter. we started out with that eight in chef's knife and guys that is your workhorse you're going to reach for that over and over and over now you're going to get every piece in here that you're going to use every day including our eight inch bread knife everybody has to have a good bread knife now true test of a knife historically always that tomato guys i gotta tell you Whoa. something these are those knives that people talk about these are the knives you see on every cooking show every type of food show these are the ones that the professional chef wants these are the ones the newlywed wants the new cook the fresh cook the professional cook they want them all, guys, and that's what we're talking about right there, okay? And by the way, here's a little tip for you. I love, love, love having the length in the blade. If you ever have to do you know, a little salad, yeah, you know, yeah, a little yeah. spinach, you want to do some cherry tomatoes, here's a trip for you. Because you have the length in the blade, you can do something like this. Take two plates, pop them together, no. simply run this across, and now you've got perfect sliced cherry Mark, tomatoes. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me with that? I'm I love the quality of these knives. So here's the thing. <laughs> you could not buy, it. you go to any store in America, these mm -hmm. are the knives that are kept under lock and key. Exactly. These are the ones with that fully forged. These are the one with the higher quality of steel. But you can't go to any store in America, and I, I defy you to find just the chef's knife for $100. Totally. I mean, seriously. Absolutely right. You so know, it's almost like buying a chef's <laughs> knife and getting everything else for free. Isn't that the truth? The one I have in my hand now, this is your five and a half inch prep knife. This is my favorite. This is halfway between that chef's knife and a pre and a, uh, a paring knife. This is kind of that, uh, that catch-all. This is the one that's going to take care of every job from meat to vegetables to fruit in the kitchen. And I'm going to pause and say it again. Triple riveted, full tank, stainless steel, Henkel quality knives. These are cold forged. Okay. That means that these have been brought down to negative 90 degrees, hand sharpened and brought back up to temperature. Oh, wow. So when it comes time even for the toughest jobs, and I want you to see this, guys. Yeah. I'm going nice and slow. A lot of times when you see a big job like this, yeah. there's a lot of force going through it. Can you see how slow <gasps> and controlled lies. I'm going through that until I get bored and Woo! I want to do this? <laughs> guys, that's what we're talking about when we're talking about nice. this kind of quality knives. So think about it. We've seen the chef's knife. We've seen the bread knife. We've seen the prep knife. Now I want to show you the utility knife. Okay. And I love this because... Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, right? like, that's a cool shape, like a little bird's beak going well, on, right? Well, here's the deal. Prep knives are meant to be the approximate length from the top of your wrist to the tip of your finger oh, because yeah. you're doing close work. Oh, that You're makes doing sense. work towards yourself. Right. So you want to be able to have that perfect control oh, every time smart. you do it. And by the way, when you talk about an edge, yeah. there is nothing quite like the edge of a hankle. I want you to see this, okay? okay. Again, since uh, the mid 1700s, 277 <gasps> years ago, <gasps> J.A. Henkel has been cold forging knives the right way, made in Germany. Again, these are the legacy knives, and you can see this, yeah. guys. So thin, I'm gonna pause. These are the I can knives. take that, yeah. and watch this, run it up. I can read through that. In fact, <laughs> it almost works like a magnifying glass. There's yes. the twins. There's the win, and there's the made in Germany. Guys, That's these crazy. are the knives to have. Okay, here's the thing, though. Only for the next 200 of you, 270 to be exact. The other uh, caveat here is that FlexPay is good for this hour. Right. So you can get it for a $20 bill only for this hour and only for this show. So basically, three minutes are sellout. I don't even know that's going to make the three minutes. All right, right. what are you doing well, for us now? You know what it is? It's J.A. Hankels. It's, the tw it's Zwilling. That's the twins. Right. This is the real deal. These are your legacy knives. And by the way, this is that knife that I was talking to you about that's my favorite and you can see that right through the skin of a salmon like it's not even there and that's what I love and even when it comes time to give it that <gasps> quick look at that little fillet oh, this Kelly. knife actually has the edge quality control that we need to make those kind of wow. cuts I'm going to do that one more time because I want you to see this okay even like in a smaller panel of that salmon which is exactly. harder to do so we're going to go ahead and just like this. I don't need a bend in the knife. I don't need a $200 sportsman's knife. All I need is the quality of okay, Hankel's. Crazy. Isn't that great? Now have a look here and I'm going to walk you through these knives again. Okay. Because I really want you to understand hey, Mark, what you're getting. Mark, I do want to let everybody know we have more people calling. We do I have love quantities it. remain. So at this point, we've maybe got time for Mark to show you everything that's in the set again. If if, we, if he had you at hello, I know he had you at Hankel. Oh, we are calling it gone. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> the chef's <laughs> knife pays it. for the purchase. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Okay, so uh, Mark is going to stick around. We also have another one of my favorite items in the kitchen in just a moment. But our Debbie Meyer Genius Hooks are also available for a clearance price of $12.95. We've got a couple hundred, and that is all. Remember, all of these clearance items are done when I am done. And then, of course, 12 midnight. Uh, oh, also, uh, Wolfgang Puck, all of his items are in a special flex pay as part of our clearance event, and he also celebrates his big anniversary with us in August. So five pay flex pay on any of your 19th anniversary with Wolfgang Puck. And without further ado, not only does Mark have another dynamite item in the kitchen for us, if you have not seen or heard of the Michael Todd, you know, sonic cleansing tool, where have you been? From Allure to In Style to People Magazine to Vogue, beauty editors are raving about this. And not only because of the ergonomic shape, I want you to see something. It moves faster. Can you even perceive how it's it's moving? This actually moves faster than the human eye can, can perceive motion. And that means means not only patented antimicrobial brush heads, which no one else in the world has, but you're getting precise, precision, deep cleaning at the touch of a button. So lowest price in history, that's coming up at 12 midnight. In the meantime, I cry for air frying. I want to air fry in my oven. Mark Gill is putting French it. fries. He's putting all the crunchy munchies back on the menu. Chicken wings back on the menu. Mark? The big reveal, please. Here we go. Let me tell you something. Bell and Hal and our friends here at the network are about to turn every single oven in America, including yours, into one of those fancy dancy new air fryers. The best part is you don't have to spend another dime because you already have the oven. What you're missing is the right pan. So let me show you something here, okay? These are those mozzarella sticks, man. Everybody loves these. And in order to cook these properly, you got to dip these in oil. They've got to sit in fat. They've got to sit in all that extra calories yeah. and cholesterol. Ooh. Or you can let... <gasps> the crisper plates from Bell and Hal go ahead and give you this oh, treat that you what? love so much. Your red much. is already gone. What? Your red is already gone. Holy it's moly. It's like a buy <laughs> one, get one. The last time I had I these on it. the air with Mark, they were almost twice the price. So your red is gone, and we've got the green with the black. Frankly, the color is irrelevant. It's what this right. does that makes it so special. Yeah. So air, there's there's no like hot and cold spots with this. Nothing. Where Absolutely nothing. Wherever there's air. Exactly. Have a look here, and here's what we've done. We've given you a tray with a mesh bottom. Guys, that's the magic. Your oven is 16 square feet of hot, supercharged air. These pans allow 
allow it to work 360 degrees around your food. Neat. Think about what a deep fryer does. Yeah. It surrounds your food with hot oil. Right. Fantastic. Crisps right. it up, tastes terrific. The problem yeah. is there's so much extra fat. Right. Holy moly, Isn't there's so true? much extra fat. When you can use air, which is one of the reasons that air fryers are so gosh darn popular, yeah. you get the same taste, the same results, with so much less yeah. calories, so much less fat, and holy moly, in the time that it takes to cook this, it takes your deep fryer to hook, uh, you know, to heat up that much. So let's have That's, a good look at these, okay? okay? First things first, you've got a steel uh, uh, outer border, which means yeah. these are tough as nails. In fact, Shannon, do, do me a favor here. Okay. Grab one of these. Okay. Give it a tug. No, it's not a TV tug. It's a tug. Okay. <laughs> this is meant wild. exactly oh, and designed cool. to last you for years and years. And you see this mesh? This is coated steel. This steel actually has a non. Whoop, there we go, a non-stick <laughs> surface on it. So not only are you gonna get better food, but you don't have to clean that pan. Yeah. Now, this is designed to hold a standard two pound bag from your grocer's oh, freezer. Perfect. 1.78 to 2.2 yeah. pounds is how big 95% of those bags are. So guys, that's all you're doing. And have a look here when I tip it up. You can see the fries through the bottom yeah. of the pan and there's your magic. So when I bring it over here, let okay. me grab a cloth because I'm pretty sure all right. I've got some finished ones. Through the magic of television, <laughs> right? Because guys, you know what it's all about? Uh, if, 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 if you go off of that, uh, you know, you, you don't treat yourself, you don't get that little right. crunch every now and yeah. then, you binge. So go ahead and allow yourself to do this, but in a healthy Absolutely. way. Absolutely, but you know what? The truth of the matter is a French fry is not that bad from a nutritional standpoint. No. It's the oil. My kid's it's, school it, says it's a vegetable. Right, I mean, it's, it's a <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's the fat that we're frying them in. Exactly. You can see how golden brown those are from here. And I do want you to see the quantity left. You know, Mark's first item sold out earlier or faster than it was supposed to. And we expect the same thing to happen here. 2,000 and 2,000 only. This will not be back at this price ever again. <laughs> so I don't care if it's potato skins or poppers or exactly. pizza. I mean, go down the list. Any of your favorite munchies that we mm -hmm. like, the crunchy munchie. Exactly. You get the crunchy munchie. You can even hear the crunchy So here's mark. what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to all nice and all nice and pretty. I'm going to take these with my with my tongs and my spatula. I'm going to put them on the plate, but here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the last few, and I'm just going to do it with my hands, because I want you to see something. In fact, I'll do this a little bit, because here's what I want you to see. Look at this, you guys. There is no wow. grease on these. And look, I got a date later. I couldn't <laughs> do this if I had a date, right? And remember, you're getting both of them. You're getting the large one and the small Absolutely, one. Absolutely, but you it. know what? You're not getting any waste either. When you think of traditional frying, not only is it very caloric intensive, you know, B, it's a hassle. You know, there's fat spitting all over your kitchen. You smell like a French fry. It creates a mess. <laughs> and then what do you do with the oil? You have to chuck it. You have to either, you know, keep using it, which is not necessarily good, because you can see how it's collecting debris. Right. Or, of course, you can change it out, and then that's cash in the trash. You're just throwing money away. To me, there is no smarter or better way to not only air fry, but do it in the convenience of your own home without another expensive contraption. Right. You know, air fryers generally sell for $200 or more, right. depending on exactly. you know, you know, where you're shopping. Guys, you bought an oven. Yeah, you're right. You bought an oven. You got an oven. <laughs> you can do you this. You got the oven. In fact, how many of you have seen this? You have that metal bottom pan, and unless you sit there with a stopwatch and a timer and know exactly what it turns this is going to sit in the fat. It's going to do the thing. And by the way, when I come up here, are, are you kidding me with this? It's the HSN <laughs> wiener hat. Look at this, you guys. It sticks. I don't want to spend oh, the next two weeks trying to make this pan oh, look like it did when it was new. And you know, even when it comes to simple foods like this, even when it comes yeah. to simple foods like this, the cleanup alone is a nightmare. It is. But who wants to serve this to their family and friends? So let me show you an easier way. Okay. No turning, no burning, nope. no flipping, no flopping, and no babysitting. And guys, no. look at this. Look 360 at degrees. Perfect. You know, and pigs in a blanket are food group to me. <laughs> They're on the food pyramid. I swear to you. Okay, we are saying five minutes or sellout. Love and it. these are going. We have fewer than 2,000. We have almost 1,000 people joining us in the various forms of ordering. <laughs> That's great. So the thing is, to Mark's point, and you know what? This, it looks like this would even fit in a toaster oven, depending on the size of the toaster well, oven. Well, we we're, we're going to give you one tray okay. that's designed to fit 99.9% .9 of the toaster ovens out there. In fact, oh, follow me over there, yeah. and I'll show you that. Because, you know, here's the thing, you guys. The number one reheated food in the country is pizza, period. It's yes. not even a race for second, all right? True. But here's the problem. You get that floppy mess all over yeah, the place. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. you have now pans that are designed to fit that toaster oh, oven of yours. Smart. So I'm going to go ahead and put this up here, and I'll pop my pizza in. So now it's not going to flip. It's not going to flop. No. When we're done, it's going to be that love crispy it. pizza that you love. And so let me pull this what? over here. Even at the office, for the RV, for the dormitory, for the snowbird, I mean, for anyone who just has a small space, you got an oven, whether it's a toaster oven or not. And look exactly. at that. 
You know, here's the thing. Here's what I want you to see, okay? That's the front, that's the back. That's the front, that's the back. That's the front, that's the back. That's the front, the back, the front, the back. I never had to flip these. Yeah. I never had to babysit no them. Flipping, I never had to no worry kidding. about them. Absolutely not. So, so when you've got cool. your little ones, you know, at home at lunchtime, and you want them to have something beyond that, that garbage that they're right. eating, you know, if they're going to reach into that freezer and they're going to get that convenience food, we can't stop them. At least stop them from frying right. it. Right. Look at this. I can take the simplest frozen fish and make it look like it's a meal that I got at a restaurant. It, absolutely. Right? So here's the thing. We have the final 1800. It looks like these could possibly sell out before we finish with the presentation. Uh, I'm sorry, Allison. E Elaine is calling. Hi, Elaine. Uh, hi there, Elaine. Hi. Welcome to the show. Nice Thank to talk you. to you. I have these. I love them. My <laughs> husband does most of the cooking. Yep. And I do some, but we love them. I have them in red. Oh, nice. <laughs> I love hey, it. Elaine, do, do they make the food nice and crispy? Do you feel like you're eating healthier? Uh, it's wonderful. We don't have to flip anything over to crisp the other side. Yep. Have, Isn't uh, that the best? Breaded, breaded fish, you know, frozen fish, our, our fries, our potatoes. It's wonderful. And it doesn't stick at all. Nice. Well, Elaine, we thank you so much for sharing the good word. I hope you've been enjoying our clearance today. Thank you, Elaine. But now you're putting buffalo wings back on the well, menu. Well, listen, here's the thing. You can go to the sports bar, especially with all the seasons kicking up into full force, and you can go ahead and spend $17.95 on that. Yes, you can. With all the extra fat, calories, and cholesterol that comes yeah. with it. Or... Do it in the oven the way it was intended, the way the manufacturer wanted you to do it. Right. They don't want you to stick it in oil. What they want you to do is go ahead, put it in the pan with the mesh bottom because that allows the 360 degrees worth of hot air to envelop and circle all around your food. Nice. So you get those same types of results that you see with the fancy dancy air fryers all That's over the great. place. And you're right, they're 200 bucks. They are. You know what? And, and they're great. But, you know, for me, because I'm such an appliance, you know, I love all appliances. I, I'm kind of run a lot of room in my house. Mm -hmm. This takes up no space. And not only that, it does that job of that air fryer. So it is air frying in your oven or your oh, toaster that's oven. Hot. That was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> it's like note to self. Hello. I'm on television. <laughs> oh, now see, here's, wow. here's one of my favorite things. But you know, yep. for me, I like onion rings, but the ginger does not. I'm not going to fire up the deep fryer to do right. onion rings just for myself. Exactly. This I would do. If I feel like having a couple french fries, if I feel like <laughs> having chicken wings, if I feel like having onion rings or chicken nuggets because you're not firing up that deep fryer you know you'll probably find yourself making more food than you normally would because how many times do you say oh it's fry night and you do it once maybe a month because it's a hassle to clean up exactly. right exactly now fry night could be any night of the week because you're frying without oil and you're just right. using your oven that you already have exactly and i love that you're getting two i love that they're in different sizes and you know when i was a kid I used to get home at lunch, dinner, whatever, and as soon as I walked in, there was a smell. Yeah. And it was the pizza bread. And I'll tell you, here's what I loved about the pizza bread. The top, because the bottom <laughs> right. was black when we were done. Have a look at this, you guys. These are cooked perfectly. I've got a crust on the back. I've got that crust on the back, or the, the, the crust on the top and the crust on the back. And here's what I want to hear when I cut into these, you guys. This is what I love. You ready? Okay. You hear that? Ooh, that's what you want. Exactly. And what I love is, uh, unlike a solid bottom pan, this, as the moisture escapes from it, your bread ends up having to sit in it. It does. Which drives you crazy it, it because does. it just makes for wet bread. It, Why on earth would you but want that? you know that? what? You heard what Elaine in Michigan said, no flipping. I mean, no flipping. No flipping. I mean, if, if that didn't have you right there, we have a couple hundred available if we consider everybody who's joining us in the various forms of ordering. Here's another thing. I love egg rolls, but, yep. you know, when I get home at 3 and 4, clock in the morning I'm not gonna yeah, I'm not gonna turn you know deep fry an egg roll but I want something like that as a snack I'll exactly. turn on my oven turn on your oven and yeah. pop the pans in and you don't even have to sit there with a the timer so you know when to turn them over and you see I'm turning each one of these over guys it's golden brown on the top it's golden brown on the bottom I don't have all of the extra fat calories and cholesterol so I can go ahead and I can have that treat every now and then if I want it without having to worry yeah. about all the guilt associated with it and it's so smart. If you're a baker, oh, listen yeah. up. Okay? I bet. Dough wants to breathe. It wants <laughs> the air. When you choke it off with that met bottom pan, yeah. you wreck the bottom of it. So no, I want you, you to do. watch this right here. Ready? 
That's oh, what the package promised me. It, it promised me flaky. Wow. It promised me beautiful. So next Sunday, when you want that chocolate croissant, that steamy, oh, bubbly, wow. flaky, buttery, perfect, this oh, is the way Mark, to do I'm it. I'm telling you. So from reheating to frying without oil, I mean, it's just, it's a genius move. And exactly. basically, it's like buy one, get one free, because the last time Mark and I presented these, they were $30. Remember, one is sized to fit in that toaster oven. So RVers, snowbirds, dormitories, if they got, even have the little pizza or, you know, counter oven, you can do it. And, well, you got a little smorgasbord going on there. You don't get this size eating broccoli. <laughs> all right, look at this, you guys. This is what it's all about. About that cleanup. I'm just going to go ahead and tip this because I've always said if something's hard to clean, you will never touch it again. Yeah. It's already clean. <laughs> exactly. I love it. Mom, I did the dishes. <laughs> Mom, dishes are done. And I made dinner. Exactly. Mark, thank you so thank much. You. Always good to see you. Uh, so in 30 minutes time, we have for you not only your first look at our finest value of the day, Michael Todd as a company, they are known as innovators. They are pioneers. They have patented a technology whereby not only are you going to get the clean healthiest, youngest looking skin because no debris left behind, but the brushes even go to work for you. This is a patented technology where they are antimicrobial. No one else in the industry has that. We're going to give you all the details uh, coming up at 12 midnight. And if you're a fan, of course, we would love to say hi to you. So please call with your testimonials at midnight. In the meantime, we've got more kitchen clearance coming up. So don't go anywhere. Uh, I spy John Florell and more. Don't go anywhere. It's Lynn's 25th anniversary. We've got surprises galore for her very special anniversary, plus a look back over her years at HSN. And check out her all-time favorite items and brands selected just for you. Plus, get special anniversary pricing, special flex pay, and free shipping on select items. Let's celebrate her momentous milestone. The party begins on Friday at 5 p.m. Check out all of Lynn's must-have picks. Search Lynn Murphy at hsn.com. For luxury, heritage, and style comes Perlier. Exquisitely crafted, natural ingredients, where tradition meets modern science. The ultimate spa experience. No appointment necessary. Shop Perlier Monday. The appraised values you see at HSN are set by independent, professionally certified appraisers. They determine, as closely as possible, the approximate retail cost of replacing or recreating the item, not the possible sell or purchase price. Because subjective estimates and judgments are involved, appraisals may vary by as much as 25%. Call your customer service rep for more information. We've got your name, we've got your number, you like a sale, favorite four letter word in the, in the universe. Yeah, right. right, John? Absolutely. John's back, and when we were texting earlier, we're like, oh, this is just a heck of a deal. I know. This is just <laughs> a heck of a deal. Because I said, when I, I saw the price, I know. Like, what? I'm like, that's what I didn't know. He's like, oh, it's a heck of a deal. Yeah. Okay. The, the, I, see, now I'm speechless. It's not one knife for $17.50. Right. You it's get the whole set all six knives. For that, let me run through them real quick, Kim. Okay. okay, you get your chef's knife. All right. Now the the difference though is these are ribbed blades. All right. Yeah. And I'll explain that in a second. But where can you go to get a set of six knives right. with matching sheaths? Okay, for for this kind of price. I, know, I mean, come on. You, so the, you've got for the chef's knife. We have the Santoku knife. We have the slicing knife yeah. for your slicing. We have a bread knife. All right, bread and bagel knife. We have our uh, 
utility knife, this one I love, and a paring knife, and again, all of them come with their That's own nice. individual sheaths, so you can keep them right in your yeah. knife drawer. I was gonna it, say, I wish they all had that. So we've got yeah. black or the red, black is almost gone. Well, black, black or purple. Yeah. Well, uh, so if you want John's red, too oh. bad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Didn't know that. <laughs> well, we've go. got, we've uh, like already earlier today, I don't know what it was oh. like, almost 4,000 yeah, of them have exactly. been sold. Right, I so mean, at this price, actually, how can you go Allison, wrong? Can we do that to John's point? Like one show over 4,000 <laughs> gone. Look at we this. We have the final 2,400. And I'm telling you, John, I'm telling you, that's a, that's a deal breaker here's, for me. I wish every knives, all uh, knives came like uh, that. With a sheath. Absolutely. Yes, I do. But here's the problem with a flat blade knife. Now, everybody's got a drawer full of knives like sure. this. The problem problem is when you start, try and slice with them, okay? Yeah. When you slice with a flat bladed knife, you might get a couple slices like this, right? Yeah. But then all of a sudden the food starts to stick to the blade and that next thing you know is popping up over the top. Yeah. You can't see what you're slicing. You have to scrape it off with your finger and almost cut yourself. Yes. And it doesn't matter, like it doesn't matter if it's a banana or a potato. Yeah. They, everything sticks to a flat bladed knife like this. Yeah. And I mean, you can sit there and shake and shake and shake, but you have to peel right. it off the blade. No, you do. Now, True. that's why Kitchen Master has developed this that this is one of the best ideas in the kitchen that's come along for the kitchen in a while. The ribbed blades, okay? So now, nothing sticks to the blade no. because of those air channels that channels the air between the oh, blade yeah. of the knife and the food. So no matter how thick or how thin you want to slice, again, nothing will stick to that blade. And just for the record, so, that is an overly ripe banana. And yeah, you know those, it's those, super ripe. You know, yeah. I, mean, those, I mean, those are really adhere to a blade. Well, and even a potato like sure. this. I mean, normally a potato will stick to, I mean, the, the, uh, here's where I say, you yeah. try it out, okay? And here's where you'll notice the difference. That cheese, okay, this is that box oh, cheese, that super yes. soft, melty, ooey gooey cheese, right? Look at this, I mean, normally, here, if you tried to slice this with a flat blade knife, oh, look at this. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> wow. it just sticks, you have to peel it, literally peel it off the blade like this. But with the ribbed blades, watch this, I mean, okay. look, all you do is move it and it cuts it. You get perfect slices oh, and nothing I sticks to that blade. That because, <laughs> but you know what, you know what? Because those air I, channels. I, I almost never buy it for the reason that it's it, it, it's almost like a magnetic adhesion yes. to any nut, isn't it true? And it's like, then you're peeling it off <laughs> right. there and then it doesn't have the slice. I think that's one of the reasons that people melt it. Yeah. Because you can't <laughs> yeah, get it right. off, right? Because it never looks pretty. That's exactly Exactly so, right. Uh, or how about mozzarella? Oh, yeah, uh, that's you ever done like for caprese? I mean, you're gonna love this blade. And it doesn't matter whether you're using the chef's knife or here, I'll, I'll pull out the Santoku knife, okay? I want you to see this. I'm gonna point this towards the camera so you can see as I move this knife and it cuts, it slices off perfectly like this, yeah. you can see kind of how those air channels. Can you see how it separates because of those channels in the blade like this? So when you move it, it slices, but it doesn't stick to the blade because it's got those those air channels yeah. that are built in to this stainless steel blade. Now the handles are ergonomic. Again, just for the price alone, oh, I mean, please. think of the gifts these would make yeah. for house warmings, uh, weddings, uh, anniversaries, way, showers, divorces, uh, yeah, yeah, any, really? any happy occasion. Right? Yeah, you know, they're gonna fight over who gets the knife. Yeah. <laughs> this is what the purple looks like, kind of FYI. And then we have a few of the black, final 2000, and this is your last shot. So for $17.50, Basically, it's it's a half off sale, and this is it. All of these clearance opportunities they disappear, they go away. So when you see the Michael Todd cleansing tool coming up at midnight, none of these offers are valid. This is your last chance on the air. You know, I got to tell you, John, if all you were getting is that that you know super size oh, chef's knife, yeah. you've paid for or the, the Santoku. Or the yeah, Santoku. I mean, I mean you have. What, what do you uh, what would you spend on a good knife? And right. here, I mean, I'll, I'll hold this out over this plate out here, but I mean, they're razor sharp, super sharp stainless steel blades, and with those air channels. You can see how it'll, I mean, it'll cut everything but bad habits and taxes. But take a look. I mean, one of the hardest things to slice in the kitchen is not necessarily something hard, but something soft. But look, even with a red, ripe, juicy tomato like this, all you do is move the knife and it cuts. Nothing sticks to that blade because of those air channels. And nice. again, when you get an entire set of these knives. Oh, yeah. I'm just using the Santoku knife right, right now. But again, all you do is touch it and it cuts it. Okay, that, you know what's so interesting? Just yeah. everything you've done, 
on is a cutting nightmare in the kitchen. I mean, right. soft <laughs> buffalo mozzarella, the yep. bananas, the, you know, that the cheese, the peppers, all the things that, you know, John, we spend a lot of money on our ingredients. And if yes. we've got a knife where things adhere to it, where you're trying to peel things off or they're not sharp, right. then you're really kind of ruining the prep for whatever mm -hmm. you're doing. And uh, uh, listen, whatever it is that you want to slice with these knives, the best part about it, and anybody that's ever used a knife in the kitchen will tell you. Yeah. I mean, we've all yeah. used knives. Yes, we have. You don't like those, you don't like the food sticking to the blade. No, you don't. Well, now with the precision and now with the sharpness, now yeah. with those ribbed blades, That's okay, smart. nothing sticks to the blade. So yeah. you can do those delicate, intricate jobs like slicing cucumbers or slicing right. uh, mushrooms like this for a salad. Or maybe, um, well, here, that, that was just using the paring knife. Yeah. Again, they come with their own sheaths, so you rinse these off. Smart. Or you can put them in the dishwasher. Right. I always say never put a knife in the dishwasher because it'll end up dulling the blade. Right. All right? right. And with the sheath for like sure. this, they're aerated. All of the sheaths have these aeration uh, slots in them, so you don't have to worry about moisture yeah. on the blade when they're in the drawer. Absolutely. All right? You know, but sheaths you know, that don't have that, you pull the knife out, and what do you get? Yeah, I know you get <laughs> right? that condensation. Yes. You know, or it's a collector of debris <laughs> right. or of things. So here's the thing: we are saying five minutes or sell out, and you know, this is not breaking the bank either. I mean, if it's time, to just yeah. get another second set of knives. And let's be honest: we can all use extra knives in the kitchen, especially ones at seventeen dollars and fifty cents, where you get an entire set. Right. You know, the great thing is whether we're talking housewarming, kids going off to college, their first apartment, that extra set of knives that you're always going to need. The interesting thing, though, John, is though, even though you can spend a lot more money on knives, yeah. you'll probably find yourself go, this will, might, will probably be your go-to set just because you're not fighting with it, trying to get stuff off the blade. That's right. Now, I, and that's the truth, that when you're using the, 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 uh, the knife, now this is the bread knife, right. okay? It's got that extra long blade, and I gotta tell you, Shannon, I've got a, a bread knife at home yeah. that I bought about 10 years ago, and it was like $80. Right. All right. Yeah. I, I take Absolutely. take a lot of no, good I care with that knife. Now, the problem is with that knife, right on the blade, it was stamped use on bread only. Oh, okay. You're right. Now, here, I'm taking our bread knife, yeah. slicing, uh, you can slice melons, you can slice sure. uh, your citrus fruits, you can slice tomatoes with this knife. Because it's a universal knife, again, you can slice paper thin slices like this. I mean, look at this. With a serrated oh, nice. knife, uh, like a bread knife, I don't have to worry about it because it's the quality of the stainless Beautiful. steel blade and that rib design, but you know, it's made for bread. Yeah. And I'll tell you what, for slicing bread alone, uh, you, you know how it is, that soft, yeah. that gooey bread, fresh out of the oven, hot angel food cake, yeah. great as a bagel knife. I mean, it, let's face it, when's the last time? I'm so we, glad you mentioned angel food cake, because that's like my favorite with <laughs> You that. ever oh. done this? Oh. Okay. <laughs> you yes. make those bread sticks, yes. and, and then try and fit that in the toaster, I, yeah, <laughs> and then when it doesn't fit, you stretch it back out. Yeah. I, I, how would you even butter something but like that? it's so that, funny, right? like even last night, I was trying to slice, you know, egg, a, a little uh, 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 egg McMuffins. I was yeah. making like little, you know, uh, muffin sandwiches. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, I squished them so bad because I didn't have a bread knife. Right. I thought, well, what's the point? Because they don't, you know, they don't look good. <laughs> right. The other thing is, though, too, just in terms of your produce, if you're not, if you don't have a sharp knife, things are sticking to your knife. You're not cutting evenly, and then that's hard when you're doing a sauce or a reduction oh, or sure. a gravy or soup or whatever you might be uh, cooking with with those ingredients. Now, this uh, this is the slicing knife, and I tell you, you're going to use this one more than anything. Yeah. It'll be your go-to knife for sure. Because with this one, it's got that long blade, so if you need to do intricate cuts like or maybe you want to do something like you want to split a cucumber, one of those long English cucumbers, okay? You can split that cucumber, but then you can lay them out flat, and you can use it as a chopping knife. You can use it as a slicer like it was made to be used for, okay? And get, you, you know, get as preci precise as you like, but it's razor sharp, and Whoa. I want you to see this. As I'm slicing through here, again, nothing sticks to the blade. No. It doesn't pick up the piece of food with the blade like no. with most kitchen, no. you know, flat-bladed knives. I gotta tell you, where now, were you last night? I was at that big bullseye <laughs> store. I got right? three serrated knives, it was $21. Right. It was like right. over 20 bucks. I I'm know. serious. Like, and, I mean, just think like about little it. steak knives. Not even like cutting, like, you know, but I mean, just like, you know, to cut meat, right. basically. And I'm thinking, what? This is in that the soft, world? soft cheese. Oh, that's my favorite. <laughs> Do you know what? You had me at that. Uh, I, if you no, use I'm it for serious. nothing but slicing cheese, yeah. I mean, and again, here you get an entire set. That's you get crazy. the chef's knife, you get the santoku knife, you get the paring knife, you get the slicing knife, you get the bread knife. I mean, 
I think I forgot one in there. There's so many knives <laughs> you that you get pairing? with this set. What's that? Pairing? I think I said the okay. paring knife. Okay. But look at this. Okay, and I'm going to hold sheaths. this again. So you can see the idea here is these ribs, okay, yeah. that are built into the blade. Now they're just in the blade. They're not on the sharp edge, oh, okay? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. a razor sharp edge. But can you see Good those point. air channels? So as you're slicing through your food, yeah. those those channels channel the air between your food and the knife oh, blade smart. so it's not going to stick to the blade yeah. and cause problems or you know get in the way right. of anything so hey, i mean for thing. your caprese look at that we have That's the perfect. final 1200 we have almost as many people calling it as we do have quantities remain 100 in the black and the balance of which are in the purple which you know purple and red are my two favorite colors but you know the whole idea is it's not even about the color at this point it's about getting an entire <laughs> yeah. kitchen makeover worth of knives for less than a 20 dollar bill That's right. crazy when you you think about it. I, it. It really is. I mean, yeah. when you're looking at the, <laughs> I mean, I mean look you at couldn't that. get one of these knives at this price. And I got a lot. You got to love it. Yeah, for sure. All right. So yours is available if you are still calling. So just remember, this is the the grand finale of everything. Uh, oh, John, you're gonna yeah. show this live real quick. I, yeah, okay. the, the rocking knives. Okay. okay. If, yeah, okay. these. Are, if you haven't seen you. them, I think I've got one over here. I'm just gonna oh, grab you know the green ones. I almost bought some at that other uh, website. Let me tell you, these things are great. You've got. In fact, here, let me do something real quick with the rocking knife the best part about these okay we've, i know we've got limited quantity oh, on these. these you have control because yeah. you never the, the blade always stays in constant contact with the cutting board yep. so you can slice dice chop mince shred you can do all of that oh, work nice. but you can do it precise because the blades never leave the cutting board no. so all you do is rock it back and forth where a normal oh, knife cool. you know normal knives some people have a hard time moving the knife back and forth like this now you have total control and you get the set of two nice so this this one, and you're gonna love this here. Okay. Let me see, do I have one? Yep, okay. here, a little piece of cucumber. I have okay. one here somewhere. Here's a cucumber. Okay. <laughs> Watch this. I love this because this one, it has those ridges, okay, so nothing sticks to the blade, but it oh. also gives you a ribbed cut. So you yeah. can get those, uh, for pickling, you're gonna love that. Oh, gonna for do doing that. your potato chips and things like that, you get that ribbed, yeah. or that rich ripple cut in it, okay, see, so I you'll love that. I for herbs, too. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> and you can use this the same way, you rock it back and forth. Little potato chips. Thank you, John. Yeah, my pleasure. Good to have you here. Hey, by the way, final quantities on our Smart Diet Scale. Now, here's what's really cool about this. It's the only diet scale in the world that will actually weigh your entire meal at once. So you can actually, so say you want chicken with rice, or you want chicken with broccoli, or you want a, a bagel with, you know, honey ham. You can actually, in each one of those quadrants that you see on your screen, you put the ingredient or the portion on the scale, and it knows, you type in the word, you've probably been chicken, it knows where the portion is, it knows how, you know, how much you should or should not be having. So $19.75. And then we also have our Pro Home Storage Canister set. In another lifetime, I might have a chance of my refrigerator looking even remotely like that. <laughs> if I can find the lonely, uh, you know, light beer in the background, I'm lucky. But for those of you who are much more organized than I am, this is perfect! A uh, 13 piece or the 16 piece 086118. And also comes with those grates too. So if you want a microwave, if you want to put them in the dishwasher, in the uh, refrigerator, the freezer, you name it, you're good to go. Now, not only one of our faves, come on out here, she's one of our faves. She's also the birthday girl. <laughs> the big 4-0. Are, are you tired of hearing pe you know, people say happy birthday to you? Uh, no. I was gonna offer to give you a spanking, but I don't know if that's approved for on-air use. So. Well, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, always later. Uh, always ask for forgiveness. That's right. <laughs> uh, so Tracy Rosa is back, and we were talking in, behind the scenes. Not only is this one of our customer favorites and one of our customer picks, right. when this is gone, it is gone. It is never coming back. Yeah. All right, Tracy, we're talking. Show everybody what you did again, then we'll show colors. Okay, please okay. do not blink, because this yeah. is a full-size kitchen cart, steel and wood. Right. Uh, zero assembly. Uh, Zero. Zero assembly. No tools, no instructions, Zero. no nothing. It's going to come to your house flat packed like this. You literally open it up. Yep. Gravity does the work for you. Right. Okay, this is the only quote unquote assembly. <laughs> uh, you feed it through. There you go. Now the entire base is secure. And then the wood top, it's already on. So That's you literally nuts. lift it up. Oh, come on. Absolutely done. Okay, I'm going to have Tracy take you on yeah. a tour of the details, but let's show you colors real quick. Okay. Um, Allison, you said the white is going to sell out first. We have a couple hundred of the white. Okay. Okay, the red Gorgeous. in the kitchen. We love the red. Are we calling this navy or just blue in the system? 
We are calling it navy. It is a navy. Yeah, so, it's nice. I mean, and there's our classic black. Mm -hmm. Turquoise, yes. I'm guessing. And then vintage bronze. bronze. Right. Vintage bronze. So here, uh, that that is also going to be the next to go. The problem is when these are gone, yeah. they are gone. They are not. We're not raising the price. Mm -hmm. I mean, we can't secure them again from origami. So remember that flex pay is good for this hour. So you've got basically 19 minutes where you can qualify for yeah. it for $22.49. And the thing is, Tracy, origami. It's really a phenomenon here at HSN. But mm -hmm. this this kitchen island or cart really holds a special place in people's hearts because it's unique unto it. Itself. We don't right. really have anything else quite like it no. in the origami repertoire. No, because I mean, this is the quality that we're talking about right here. This is a solid wood butcher block top. Please note the wood all the way around. This is two inches deep right here. Look at the beautiful grain on top here. If you have ever shopped for a cutting board, a cheese board, any type of wood board, you know how expensive it can be. So to be able to get something this big, it's two feet by two feet and be able to have it with that wonderful powder coated steel underneath. It is a true value. So here's the deal. This top shelf right here, this that wood holds 100 pounds worth of weight. Each one of these shelves underneath holds an additional 50 pounds worth of weight. So this cart alone holds a high, um, 200 pounds worth of weight on it. So think of your countertops right now. Do you have a huge microwave? Do you have the pressure cooker? Do you have big bowls of fruit? Do you have things hiding right here in your pantry that you never use because it's out of sight, out of mind, and you don't feel like lifting them out and putting them out? Now they have a home, and this home comes with zero assembly. So you literally open it up, put the latch on, put the top on, and then there you go. Here's another cool feature. See how it butts right up there to your countertop. That means it's countertop level. So that means when you're working right there, it slides over. You have that nice, even surface space. So it's, there's not going to be lifting or bringing anything down to make it match your cart. The fact that it's on wheels, absolute game changer. That means you can use it indoors, outdoors, prep inside, roll it outside. But this is what I'm talking about. When you are entertaining for the holidays, bringing that big bird out of the oven, bringing the ham out of the oven, pulling it out, prepping it right there in your kitchen, and then be able to put it right here. And then we, okay, say you've got your big bird right here. And then underneath you have your mashed potatoes, your green beans, your casseroles, whatever you have. And you just wheel that out to the dining room and put it right Right next to the dining room table, now everything is at your fingertips. You're not making multiple trips back and forth to try and get everything prepped. Because if you're like me, the holidays is a big deal. You want your table to look nice, you have all the trimmings, you have everything out there, but at the end of the day, you never have enough room for food. But look at, look at the depth, the quality. We have it propped out in many different ways here. I love this, and this is what I'm talking about, clearing up those countertops, getting those fruit bowls, giving them a home. This can be your breakfast bar. You could use it, you know, bringing out your, your bagels or you can have your cereal set up here and your juices and then it's it's a breakfast in bed. Wheel it right next I to I gotta tell you <laughs> though, th one. doesn't this look expensive? Yes. Can you believe that this is like basically a $20 bill only for the next 15 That's minutes? That's crazy. So for the next 15 minutes, you're getting it for $22 and change. And I have to say, I mean... <laughs> We're sorry to see this go, mm -hmm. but you know, all good things must come to an end eventually. So if you want that white, if you want that bronze, you do need to call now. Speaking of calls, Christina in California is a fan. Hi, Christina. Hi, Christina. Hi. Well, yeah, I have the, um, the Kitchen Island card. I bought that about, um, is it any right there? Oh, yes, Christina, yeah. we can hear you. Oh, okay. I thought I lost you. I bought it about four or five years ago. Mm -hmm. And it looks just as nice as the day I bought it. Yeah. Oh. I, yeah it, it's really good. It's really sturdy and, and um, oh, I can't think of the word. Strong. Yeah. You know, not flimsy. Right. Mm -hmm. I, and and I bought the um, the cutting board for the top and the pull out drawer. Yes, um, yeah. yes. Well, Christina, origami is everything that we say it is and so much more when you get it at home, aren't they? Oh, yes. I mean, it's, it, like I said, I've had it for years now. And it looks just like the day I bought it. Wow. Awesome. Well, Christina, we couldn't do it without you. Thank you so much for stopping by HSN. We love having you out there in California. Mm -hmm. Bye -bye. Thank you, Christina. Uh, so white is always a safe bet. This vintage, you know, coppery bronze is beautiful. Uh,
if you Okay, final 200 in that oh, okay. vintage uh, coppery bronze, and then 500 only in the white. Wow. And I'm telling you, as much as you think you're gonna use this, you will use it more. You know, whether it is for maybe some of the seasonal items, like maybe you don't bring out your Wolfgang Puck rotisserie oven mm -hmm. every day, but you could. For me, you know, I love it, whether it's, it's that mise en place, you're cutting things by mm -hmm. the kitchen, or maybe it's that cookie station when you're rolling out dough, when right. you're rolling out pizza dough, when you're making, you know, any of those seasonal baked good items. And the thing is, Tracy, it's, it's just, it's almost a shame that they can't touch this because no kidding, the quality, origami is known for the quality, but I think it's that butcher's block for me that puts it over the edge. Because I honestly at one point tried to buy just a butcher's block for my island. Right. That would pay for your purchase. A hundred percent. No, I'm serious. And, and I'm so glad you brought this up because what we did is I asked the people with origami, I said, please take this and cut it in half. This yeah. is the top. So see, you can see the wood all the way around. This is literally the top of this. But I said, do me a favor. Yep. Cut this down the middle so that people can truly see that there are no fillers inside of this. None. There's, this is not particle board. There's not a bunch of like, you know, shredded wood stuffed in here. This is that beautiful thing thick, solid wood that you're getting with this. And literally, if you've shopped for a cutting board, if you've shopped for a cheese board or anything like that, you know how expensive this can uh, be. Yeah. Look at that. And then check this out. No two are gonna be the same because Tell that you. beautiful grain wood is natural wood. That That's real wood. Gorgeous. So you can't fake that. Here's the other thing. It's just as gorgeous on the inside. Yeah. So if we're gonna skimp on right. quality, I always say, listen, before you buy your furniture and you invest in something, because this is an investment, this is a piece of furniture oh, yeah, that is going sure. to last, you know? Check out the inside, because oh, if we're gonna skimp, yeah. we're gonna do it right here, uh, okay. and we're not. When you see a clock go up, I mean, not only is that your countdown toward today's special, that is also your countdown to saying goodbye to that flex pay. So basically, you have about 12 minutes, you know, give or take to qualify for that flex pay, because we're launching that brand new beauty tool at midnight if you have had your eyes set on this if you have you know if this has been kind of in that want factor that wish list factor like it has been for me i mean honestly there is no reason to say no to this tonight especially because we're still honoring the free shipping which is kind of funny because i actually had to do a double check and take and check with my sales manager so i'm like we don't, first of all, we don't discount origami. That's number one. We never discount origami, but I'm like, did they mean to take that flex pay away? Because for this kind of price reduction, they should have. I'll just be perfectly yeah. forthright with you. Normally when I do a clearance show on one of our, our staple items or cornerstone items, if they do a massive price reduction, like they're doing only for the show, then they will take away that free shipping because you lose margin and you know, you can fill in the blanks. You know how retail works. So it's almost like a, it's a mistake that you're getting the free shipping. Yeah. So for this hour, for basically the next 12 minutes before we launch that brand new beauty tool, you're getting it for $22.49. We have a couple thousand available, 500 only wow. on that white. And then on that coppery bronze, Allison, you said a couple hundred, give or take, uh, a final 200. And remember, when this is gone, this is gone. Yeah. So sadly, you know, all good things must come to an end. Quite frankly, I think it's because it's too expensive for origami and for HSN to produce. Because with that butcher's block, if you've ever had to or tried to buy butcher's block like I did as an adjunct or an add-on to my existing kitchen island, they quoted me more than what you see on, on your screen. Mm -hmm. And frankly, it was like a little panel. It was not as thick as this. I, I actually like this better than what I looked at, you know, because I was gonna do like a little add-on on my kitchen island. I'm telling you, the butcher's block is gonna pay for the purchase. And, you know, and on top of the on top of the functionality of it, Tracy, it's just so pretty. It just, I mean, it look it doesn't look like something that you didn't have to, you know, assemble. No, no. And the fact that this is powder coated steel, the fact that it's so strong and no matter what color you're getting that powder coated yeah. steel, not gonna rust, not gonna chip, not gonna corrode. But here's the other thing. If you've brought a team in to give you a quote yes. on how much it would cost to extend that countertop, oh. to build an island, you know that it's extremely expensive. Thousands of dollars. Thousands. It's thousands. And then it's permanent. <laughs> yes. It's just where, yep. It's just where they put it in. It is. Here you go. This is an island. This is a coffee station. This yeah. is a prep station. This right. is a baking. This is when grandma comes over yeah. at Thanksgiving and she needs somewhere 
so you can snap those right. peas. Or the kids can sit and roll out that cookie dough. This yeah. is that extra station. Then after Thanksgiving, this is your wrap station. It, it is. This is your sewing station. This is your cricket station. Yeah. This is your charging station. It you is. can put your laptop, a full-size printer, and whatever else you need underneath it. It says kitchen cart, but when you have something this strong, oh, yeah. something this beautiful, it can go in any single it, room in the house. It could. My mom, it, she doesn't now because her arthritis is so bad, but she used to do part-time catering, you oh, know? Yeah. So she and one of her girlfriends, and they do catering. And, you know, honestly, I'll have Tracy show how it collapses again. Mm -hmm. If you do have a situation like that where, and maybe it's just car catering your own party, catering your own life with, yeah. you know, guests coming over, the kid's birthday party, you want some place to put the birthday cake. For my mom, when she was doing catering, this would fit easily, even in the smallest of back seats. I've got a compact car, yeah. and I could okay. still transport that Absolutely. someplace. I could. I think of tailgating. Yes. There is not, I, I challenge you, there is not a holiday that this will not yep. make easier. So true. Even as simple as Halloween. We loaded this up with a whole bunch of candy. Oh, and listen, a few bottles of wine. That's right. Hey. And not for the kids, but we rolled that down to the end, and we had some beverages. Candy's and it, dandy, but you exactly. know the rest. <laughs> But, and then and then for Thanksgiving, it literally holds that big turkey and all of my sides are yeah. underneath and I wheel it out to the table. You know, Easter, know. it holds the but big turkey. You, you know what, for the, you know, the baby shower, the bridal shower, where are you going to put the yeah. punch bowl? Where are you right. going to put, you know, the guest list? All of that. Uh, Elizabeth from Connecticut loves origami and just got her Hi, kitchen Elizabeth. card. Oh, Hi, congratulations. I have been watching it all night and it, I see it's the last off, you know, the Mm -hmm. Offer of I said I just have to get it. Good girl. Uh, Elizabeth, you having will... a small space, it's so can looks so convenient to be able to fold it up yep. yes. and store it and then just pull it out when uh company comes so absolutely well and Elizabeth so pretty it is, and it's so pretty you hit the nail on the head I mean and that's just it I mean I can tell you for a fact you'll never regret it and we are not going to be able to get these back just because of the cost of expense with that butcher's block and everything else uh, Elizabeth mm -hmm. I think you're gonna love it any plans are you gonna use it for like the turkey for Thanksgiving or, or any ideas in mind of how you're gonna put it to use uh, all the above. Yes, exactly. <laughs> all of the above. <laughs> well uh, said. <laughs> what color did you get, can Elizabeth? Fold up and put away. And yeah. Then when company's there, just pull it out. So smart. Awesome. Well, Elizabeth, I'm excited. I can't wait to. Uh, Get at home. I have several of their shelves, and I've had them for years. Yeah, they do they a great still job. Look like I just got them absolutely yesterday, and hold everything. Well, Elizabeth, I we love origami. Well, we love you, Elizabeth. Thank you so much for the phone call. We so appreciate you for being out there. Uh, and then Tracy, just to describe what you're doing again, because yeah. uh, hey, none of us has enough space. Let's be honest. We're all wishing for more square footage. What I really like is the fact that you can collapse absolutely. it when it is not in use. But please, for a moment. Don't think that that you know negates the you know the stability aspect because I'm telling you that butcher's block. I almost wish I could put it through your television at home. I might even show you that again. Yeah. I was quoted. I mean, a butcher's block. I mean, that's you, you can't fake this. I mean, it, 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 it's heavy. It's sturdy. Yeah. This is the inside. Wow. So, like I said, this is this is solid wood. Okay. So this is already attached to it. So this is zero right. assembly. So no screws. No, no drills. No nothing. It's so funny. I was going to buy. You guys have to start doing like TV armoires because I was at the bullseye <laughs> store and my eyes glazed over. First of all, they were like three hundred dollars, and then I looked at all the pieces you had to put together. I'm like, I can't deal with that. Oh. I mean, I can't. I I did bar stools the other day. What? Okay, listen, one slab of wood and for the seat yeah. and then the steel. So the same kind of right. material. I messed it up so bad. I, I had the base on upside down <laughs> and I had to use electrical tape because I was so embarrassed to show my husband how horrible I was See, at putting it the together. The guests that you don't like have them sit on that stool. Yeah, well, I, <laughs> I feel terrible. I have to put my 10 year old on it because she's oh, the lightest exactly. one. Exactly. Hey, uh, Linda in California got that white before we stamp it sold out. And don't forget, we're taking away your flex pay at midnight. Hi, Linda in California. Welcome. It's the birthday girl, Tracy and Shannon. Hi, Hi Linda. Linda. Hi. So, Linda, what made you decide to get our origami kitchen cart tonight? Well, I just remodeled my kitchen. Yeah. Ooh, congrats. And uh, the butcher block that I have right now is just way too big. Yeah. And so when I saw this, I thought, oh, how perfect is it? Yes. It's white. Yeah. And it has the color that I need. Yeah. And so it's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> and the price, you can't beat it. No. Yeah, you're so right. Linda, as much as you think you're going to love it, I think you'll even love it more because, no kidding, When I know Tracy's doing a great job showing the quality of that butcher's block, and you're right, it's the Goldilocks size, it's just right. But boy, when uh -huh. you see it in person, I think you're going to be thrilled. Oh, no, I know I'm going to be. I'm, I'm really excited to get it. Good. I saw that and I thought, oh, my gosh. That's just going to look so nice. It does. And I've been away from home for the last week, you know, in Sacramento, and I've been just getting updates on my kitchen through uh, the mail. Wow. And when I saw this, because my husband said, well, I think the butcher block we have right now is just a little too big. <laughs> That's right. Oh. And I saw this one, and I thought, oh, my God. Problem gosh. solved, <laughs> Linda. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was meant to be, Linda. I know it's going to be the jewel in the crown of that new kitchen, and thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you, Linda. Uh, by the way, if you want... Linda's white. I think Allison, okay, final 300 in Linda's white. So if that's the color that you need, the coppery bronze, uh, we have 50 of them. That's wow. the one that Tracy's demonstrating. Okay. Always hot in the kitchen as a, you know, a pop color is that red. Mm -hmm. The blue is a true navy blue. Right. The black is always a great choice. So if you don't know which one to go for, then, you know, by all means, you know, choose that black as well. Uh, and then, of course, we've got, we're calling it turquoise in the system. Doggone it. You know what? I bet I could put a flat panel top of television on this. Oh, absolutely. You can hold 100 pounds worth of weight on this. Yeah. On the oh, top yeah, shelf alone. No flat panel TV doesn't And then you put much. everything on. You put your sound system underneath. Oh, I think I'm going to do you that. You put your storage. Tracy, thing. you solved my problem. See, that's, <laughs> I, I know that we call it the kitchen cart, but literally, this has been an every single yes. room of my house. Even most recently, my husband cooked me an amazing dinner last night. This was in the kitchen, prepped all the steak yeah. and everything right here, wheeled it out to right. the barbecue, wheeled it back in. Everything just stayed right here. So it's a pretty. true game changer. Let's talk about dimensions just so you, yes. you know can okay, understand. Good, good, good it's idea. literally two feet by two feet, okay? okay? So it's that perfect size, that extra space, a continuation yeah. of your countertops. Here's the other thing. This holds 100 pounds worth of weight. This holds 50 pounds oh, worth of weight. Wow. Another 50 pounds. Holy so moly, 200 man. pounds worth of weight, this wow. will hold. Again, that countertop level, so it's gonna yeah. butt right up to the countertop. It's the perfect size. Which is great. And you know what, here's the other thing too, if you happen to be wheelchair assisted, you know, sometimes mm -hmm. the counters aren't either in a convenient spot right. or the right height. I mean, this, this helps with that yeah. as well. Also, if you've got some dexterity issues, I have some uh, back problems, et cetera. Boy, you put that toaster oven at, you know, at eye level, so to mm -hmm. speak, when you're hoisting that turkey in and out, it makes a big, big difference. So two things, uh, they're going to actually, you know, I'm going to be having Mr. Toad's wild ride down to the other <laughs> studio in just a few moments to get yeah. ready for our today's special. When you see me in two minutes with our today's special, your flex pay goes away. Wow. That four pay flex pay goes away. So I should have ordered mine before I got on the hour uh, on the air because, you know, the thing is, I, I do not have this yet. And part of the reason is, you know, to be perfectly fair, $140 was a great price, but I buy a lot of origami saying, so ah, well, this, you put this on the back burner. At this price, there is no reason to say no to this tonight. You know, this will become one of those coulda, woulda, shoulda, where you go, why didn't I get that kitchen cart? Because I can promise you, even if you're not gonna use it every day, which a lot of you do, I can promise you, promise you, promise you, in the next three to four months, you're gonna go to yourself, why didn't I get that for yeah. the graduation, mm -hmm. for the birthday, for, you know, the fill in the blank, right? right? Yeah, and so, look at how easy it's Tracy, I'm gonna let you show right. off details. No, absolutely. All right, Mr. Toad's wide, wide right. ride, I'll see you in the next there video. There you Don't go, forget, again. Your flex pay goes away. <laughs> <laughs> Zero assembly, this is what we're talking about. We're giving you a storage solution, not a storage problem. And we're giving it to you without any assembly required. No headaches, no more afternoons spent arguing with the honeydew list about putting something together. This is that solution. And this is what I'm talking about, how it butts right up to the countertop. So it's an easy transition right from your countertops right to the kitchen cart, and then you can move it wherever you want. Whether it's going to the barbecue, whether it's going to the dining room table, whether it's going out if it's a bar and it's going out to the living room where the party is. But Thanksgiving's right around the corner. Being able to pull that bird out of the oven, place it right on top of that cart and have all of its sides right underneath and then put it right next to that dining room table so that you have room for all of the loved ones to sit there. So you have room for those beautiful place settings. But let me just show you again. This is what I'm talking about. Zero assembly. Comes to your door for free, flat packs. You literally take it out of the box, you open it up. Here is your famous origami class. That is gonna secure the entire system in place. There you go. 
the wood block, it's already attached. Again, you don't have to screw anything in. You bring it over and there you go. Solid wood, powder coated steel, good for indoors and outdoors and really, Possibility is endless. White, red, blue, black. It's awesome. Congratulations if you got it. Shannon. One of the oh. All right, hey, don't forget, they had an apple crate out for me. I'm the last host that needs an apple crate. I am not one of the Lilliputians. At any rate, we have our hot items. And those are also available for you at hsn.com. Speaking of hot items. are today's special. You ready? I know I am. Every beauty editor in the world is talking about it. Lowest price in history, first come, first serve. You ready? It's your first look at our finest value of the day. Okay, the beautiful but disembodied hand that you see floating on your screen is the lovely and talented Erica Parker, Parker, who of course is responsible for not only one of the most touted, heralded beauty items of all time. So the thing is, Erica, this is gonna look familiar for a lot of people out there and they're like, oh, I'm getting my face clean, I'm doing enough. No, they aren't, right? No, you're not, exactly. You just saw me cleanse my skin for about 10 seconds. That's how long we're gonna spend washing our face if we're using our hands. Watch this, this is gonna blow your mind. Two, Woo! three, oh, and gone. Okay, and not only that, those are patented antimicrobial brushes, which this is the only sonic facial cleansing tool in the world that we can say this about. So Erica, talk me through what I'm looking through on my screen here. Okay, so what you just saw me do on my hand, we, what we did is we took it a step further. Because at Michael Todd, we're not gonna bring you something unless we put it on a model and we do a proven test study. So what we did was we took a model and we applied fluorescent makeup to both sides of her forehead. Then we put her under a black light. And that's what you're seeing at the top of your screen. 